final day, I can't believe it. I'm gonna miss this place. Let's, uh, can I open this for the last time? Can I see the cathedral for the last time? I forget the thing was like mad. I forgot to share it again. Okay. Last minute packing. left of our time here so I think we're gonna go a little bit more shopping and exploring so I might get some last minute footage kind of in a rush we're, our checkout is at 11 and it's 10 right now so we've got an hour-ish to explore minutes. 35 minutes then depends how far away we are well, yeah, um, but then we've got an hour and a half until our pickup so whether um, the girls don't want to go anywhere and they just want to relax, then we could ask them to look after our suitcases. I should recommend it. It's very nice. But it was really nice. check out now so we're gonna do a last minute stuff um, as in like check out and then we've got to wait for an hour and a half for our bus it's meant to pick us up from the hotel but who knows but let's go check out So sadly we have run out of time on our Iceland adventure, the remaining hours we had at the start of the day have come to an end and it is time to actually pick up our luggage and board the bus that is uh, currently waiting for us. It's been an absolute pleasure to be able to explore this beautiful country, Iceland. We definitely will be leaving with some very good memories. But with that said, it is time to head off to our airport and make our swift departure back to the UK.
Hey guys, we're at, how do you say the airport? What, Keflavik? There you go. Keflavik. We're, we're at that airport, we're just about to depart now. Um, sadly. Yeah, sadly. So we're waiting for our gate information, which is in literally five minutes. Yep. Um, and then we'll head to the gate and get on the plane. Um, hopefully neither of our bags get checked, because otherwise we're going to have to crush a few things. But, yeah, you know, I'm quite worried. We should be okay. I'm hoping it goes smoothly. It kind of did last time, apart from my suitcase breaking, but um, yeah, we'll see. And then we'll be back in the UK, back to the lovely lands. Average life. Mm. <laughs> it's been nice, it's been nice um, coming here. It's not as cold as I thought though. No, and I wish bought, it was. We've bought like a ton of gear. We'll probably do like a um, what we brought with us kind of video, probably not now, but maybe uh, next week or something. Um, but the trip hasn't ended here. Even though we're going back to the UK, we've got other stuff planned, so... Yeah, this is a whole extended on for a weekend too, but not here. Yeah, back in the UK. So, um, yeah. We just need to get a good night's sleep for tomorrow. Basically. <laughs> Unlike last time. Hey guys, we don't know if we recorded last night, um, we got a bit of a rush, we were quite hungry, we got off the plane, um, we got back to our hotel, we checked in and went out and got Mackie's because we haven't had one in five days. So I hope you guys all enjoyed the Iceland side of our trip, um, it was really enjoyable, first holiday away, me and Shan, and uh, it was pretty cool. Now we've just packed the car, um, we're about to head to um, a wildlife park, uh, Longleat, uh, me and Shan have both been previously but we've actually decided to come here again. Um, and yeah, so this will either be a continuation of yesterday's because it was kind of like we us coming back and not really doing much, or it's a completely new video. Speaking of Shan, it's Shan. So, 
so yeah if you haven't already guys hit the like subscribe um we're gonna get cracking on with this journey and if you haven't seen the iceland side of the trip then go crack on and see part one two three maybe four link it um, somewhere the links around and uh yeah we'll get cracking on so we'll catch you guys in a bit